Alrighty then, hello everyone, my name's Caden, and welcome um, to Nintendo Direct. Uh, it's gonna start in about like three minutes, so if you want to skip ahead for that, then go on ahead. But, uh, yeah, I don't know what to expect. Uh, all I know is that there's not gonna be any talk about Nintendo Switch successor, and there's all, it's only gonna be talking about, like, games that are gonna release for the Switch itself. They're not going to talk about anything related to a new console. So, do I have any rec uh, any wishes or anything like that? Honestly, not really. I kind of just want... Uh... Honestly, I don't know what I want. I just want something cool. I'll probably be happy with whatever we get. Probably. Maybe. But, I guess things that I could think of. I mean, something Xenoblade related would be cool. I guess. Uh... Yeah, I got nothing. I don't know what they could reveal. I mean, what what things in the past have they have they announced that have yet to come out? I mean, there is of course Metroid Prime Four, but I feel like at this rate, Metroid Prime Four is probably going to be something that comes out with the Switch's successor. It, it, that's still interesting to me. You know, Metroid Prime Four, that game was announced when the Switch was like announced or whatever, right? And we have. The only news that has happened of that game, I'm pretty sure, is that they announced that they had to, like, restart development on it because they weren't happy with what how it was going, and they wanted to use, like, the original team, I think, that made the Met Metroid Prime games. I think that's what I heard. But it's still fascinating to me that we have not heard anything related to that, to that game in forever. Like, again, that game was announced, like when the switch was like it was like one of the first switch announcements or whatever and yet it is non-existent uh you know another game that actually is similar to that is uh dragon quest 12 wasn't dragon quest 12 also also only had like its logo announced and then that was it i think so but yeah, I mean, I guess it'd be cool to see some one of those two get announced, but at the same time, I feel like if it, if either of those two would be announced, it would probably be for the Switch's successor. But anyways, it should be starting any minute now. Uh, in just a minute, I think, because it's 9.59. But hopefully there's something interesting here. Er. Uh, but only one way to find out. It's about time for it to start. Any second now. Uh, Sorry, I got an alarm. Uh, any time now. Hello? Mighty... Oh, there we go. Alright, let's see what we got. Also, sorry if it's a bit quiet. I don't really know the settings for this, so we're just going live with it. All right, what's the first announcement? Mario. Uh, uh, Luigi. Wait, why is this look? Why does this look like? What is this? Wait, the style almost makes me think of something. This is a very interesting style, though. Luigi. Oh, whoa. Is this Mario and Luigi? Oh my god! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Holy crap, it actually is! <laughs> yeah! <laughs> wow, we're already off to an interesting start. Mario and Luigi is, re is back. People were... I, me too. I really wanted to see this series come back. It'd be great if there were a way to get back home. I was really wanting to get another one of these games too. But people were scared that these games wouldn't come back because of Alpha Dreams go being gone, but uh, guess not. I had a feeling it was like I had a feeling it was dream it was a uh, Mario and Luigi related because the way the graphics looked made me think of it. Extension Court. Oh, we even got bros cool looking bros attacks. Oh, this looks great. We're already off to a good start with this. A new Mario... You can become a UFO! Yeah, this game looks great. Oh, this looks awesome. 
Peach! Snoutwit. Hey, Bowser. Ooh. Oh, I can't wait to see. Oh my god. Yes! Mario and Luigi. Brothership. Really? Oh, November 7th. Oh, I'm definitely gonna have to play through that. Oh, thank goodness we get more Hello, Mario and Luigi. Everyone. Hello. I'm Shinya Takahashi. Hello. I'll be your guide for today's Nintendo Direct. Mario and Luigi Brothership. Can't wait. That, that looks great. New entry in the Mario and Luigi series in almost nine years. Yeah, last Mario was Paper Jam, Luigi right? Brothership. Please look forward to a seafaring adventure that unfolds across mysterious islands, as well as evolved bros moves with Mario and Luigi. Yeah! Okay, let's see the first batch of headlines. All right, we're already off to a great start, I'd say. Bring the championships oh, what the? Or on the go. Wait, is this the NES thing? The thrill of the Nintendo yep. World Championships is this was on the, the Wii Nintendo U, Switch right? System. I feel like it was. Take on over 150 Mushroom Tool. From across Should we start? Games, from this is like a challenge mode. Action -packed battles. Okay, this seems neat. I don't know if I'd personally get it, but it seems neat. Yourself with each challenge and perfect your timing. Then give it your best shot. Yeah, it's a little just for the top of the online leaderboards. Yeah, it's a little just like a challenge mode. More difficult legend challenges. Hmm, interesting. Like completing Super Mario Brothers in one go using warp pipes. But, all right. Stuck on a legend challenge? Check out classified information uh. for handy tips and tricks to help you improve. <laughs> Here's some Put pro gamer tips. Test in survival mode, where you'll oh. race against ghost data of players worldwide. Huh. After each round, half of the players will be eliminated. Huh. You've only got one shot to survive. Will you be the last one standing? Me. Nintendo World Championships NES Edition launches on Nintendo Switch July 18th. Okay. Pre orders for the digital version are available now on Nintendo eShop. A deluxe set containing a physical version of the game and other bonus items pretty. is also available for pre order. That definitely looks pretty. The final battle of Fairy Tale is about to begin. Uh, don't know. Ikso, happy! Nice Relive the climactic Alvarez Empire arc from the hit anime fairy tale in this action RPG. Hmm. Don't Seven really have a last kingdom of Fiore. Team Natsu prepares to finish their fight. Yeah. Engage in real time hmm. battles and unleash powerful attacks that fuse different kinds of magic based on who's in your party. Don't really have any comments on this, honestly. Okay. Work together with your teammates to take down powerful enemies. Sand. Fairy Tale 2 launches on Nintendo Switch. Kawaii this Tecmo. Winter. <laughs> Next up. Embark on a multi-dimensional journey. I swear God, I looked at that and I thought near. Final Fantasy series creator. Uh, whoa, what? Nobu Sakaguchi. And uh? composer Nobuo Uematsu comes the turn-based RPG Fantasian. Huh. The world is. is slowly being robbed of its civilization. Uh? To restore his memories, uh. Leo must confront an evil entity threatening all mankind. Huh, this looks interesting. Skills uh. are the ticket to winning battles. Adjust a skill's trajectory to target multiple enemies at uh. once. Come on, nice. <laughs> you can also send enemies you've encountered to a separate dimension and fight uh. them later. <laughs> Wait, what? That's fascinating. The more enemies there are, the <laughs> goes to the pocket. In one shot. <laughs> it goes to the pocket. Let them go. Now, let us save the world together. Seems like it could be interesting. Especially with these enemy designs. Neo Dimension launches on Nintendo Switch this holiday. Curious. Another sport ah! coming to Spoko Square. Wait, what? You guys still care about this? Basketball. Basketball is being added as a free update to the Nintendo I'm gonna be Switch honest with you, I completely game. forgot this game existed. Dribble. Pass. Basketball. And shoot. 
in two-on-two -two matches using motion controls. Try out I'm still not. I still. I still feel like that's only proper to see a sports game on with Nintendo with Mies. Up to four players can also compete in five streak battle. Swish. L N R. You can team up with players worldwide in two-on-two -on -two online matches. And spam stickers like you do in in Mario Party. This free update for Nintendo Switch Sports dunks its way onto Nintendo Switch. I am surprised they're summer. still making uh, game modes for that game. Uh-oh. What's this? What is this? Curious looking design, uh, art style. It's a robot thing. Oh. Huh. Interesting looking. Oh, hi. Ooh. This is really interesting. What is this? Is this like a Metroidvania, you think? The orb. Mio. Hm. It's an array of cartoon classics. Oh boy. Leap into a new update for Disney Illusion Island. Mickey Arnold's stuff. Greatest detective is solving a mystery, and only Mickey and Mickey. friends can help. In the brand new adventure, Mystery and Mana, uncover sure. hints and evidence scattered throughout the world. I wonder if they're going to show that uh, epic Mickey case. game. What big secret lies at the end? Start sleuthing. I actually remember playing Epic Mickey a long, long time ago. Later I don't think I like ever beat it, but I remember playing it. Oh god, the cat. Adventures await. Customize your character. Cat. Dog. Baby friend Hello Kitty. Penguin. Karomi and other familiar Hot. faces in this open world adventure. Team <laughs> up with your new pals to solve mysteries and restore Friendship Island when Hello Kitty Island Adventure launches just looks as a time This makes me exclusive on This makes me think of like Switch Animal Crossing. Next year. Let's uh, get Looney in this wacky sports game. Play is Looney Tunes. Daffy Duck. Lo Pig, Looney Tunes basketball or sports. Style sports. Unleash the full power of that. Weird. Iconic levels in up to four player local co op. But watch out for falling anvils. Looney Tunes. Sure. Sports crashes onto Nintendo Switch this fall. What's up, Doug? Do you think there'll be any, uh, do you think there'll be any, a, it'll be available right now. Emergency meeting. Oh, God. New crewmate and imposter roles. Noisemaker, phantom. Alert others when eliminated as a noisemaker. Plant tracking devices on others as a tracker. Ah! Or turn invisible while taking out players as a phantom. Nice. Suss things out when this free update for Among Us sneaks on. Ah! I was literally just saying. Later today. Later today, gosh dang it! A monster army is at your command. Infinite Wolf. This is Felicidad, a realm of monsters. Those who command and raise them are called Farmagia and play a vital That's role a in the land. Strange name. Ten of Farmagia must rise up against. Also, the interesting name. Magus Ten to stop his vicious reign of the underworld. Raise monsters and lead them into the fight against the Magus. A little laggy. Plant seeds, then cultivate, and harvest them to make your buddies come to life. <laughs> you make <laughs> they can you grow animals battle. like crops. That's fascinating, I guess. Give commands to your monsters and exploit enemy weaknesses in action-packed combat. Merge all of the battle buddies in your party to call forth a giant fusion summon and recap giant dragon. Everyone, 
kill Rock. Join the rebellion to stop the Magus in Farmagia, launching on Nintendo Switch November 1st. Hmm. Oh, wait. Ah! Donkey Kong! Oh, Donkey, Donkey, Kong Donkey Kong Country Returns. Returns! Originally released on the Wii system is barreling onto Nintendo Switch. Hello, Donkey HD. Kong. The villainous Tiki Tap tribe. How many times has this game been like released? Stolen Donkey Kong's precious banana. Because I could have sworn this was on 3DS Wii. Obstacles in the way? Just stop them. <laughs> Pound them. <laughs> It's not quite the new and game that I feel like a lot of people through. want, but hey, at least it's something. Level is I guess. With hijinks, but they're no match for these top bananas. Yeah, I think about it. Is this the second Donkey Kong game yeah, to technically come out this year? I mean, we yeah, there was that Mario and Donkey Kong game, right? To high flying rocket barrels. One with like the toy Mario and things. A ride on Never played that, but I think I heard people say it was fun. Pass a Joy-Con controller to a buddy for two-player local co-op. So neat. 80 appealing levels are in store, including the additional levels from the Nintendo 3DS version. Oh, I was right. The 3DS version was a thing, so I wasn't crazy. Donkey Kong Country Returns Wow, HD that comes out next year. onto the Nintendo Switch system January 16th. All right. Oh, uh, wait. One of Donkey Kong and Diddy Kong's jungle escapades returns in HD. Plenty of wild actions and antics are in store with these Kongs. Whenever you... Next, please take a look at this. Oh, something big. Something big. What is this? Is this Zelda? Time is nigh. Oh! Finally! I was wondering when we'd hear about this. Dragon Quest III's uh, HG2D remake, or whatever. Uh, the reason I thought it was Zelda at first, because I, I thought it was like low rule. But no, this is Dragon Quest Three, the HG2D remake. <laughs> awesome! Finally we get to hear more Journey and see more. Allies, to face the oh, it looks great. On an epic adventure. I love how it looks. Memorable encounters. Octopath has made me love this kind of art style. Perplexing challenges. Ooh. And formidable monsters await. Kill. An iconic RPG. Wow, it looks great. HD 2D. Yes. Forge your own path. Volcano. The legacy begins. When? When dost thou start? Dragon Quest 3 HD 2D Remake. Comes out. To Nintendo Ooh. Switch, November 14th. Nice. Like it. Like it a lot. Very happy. Why aren't we skip cutting away? Um, wait. Huh? Experience the complete Erdrick trilogy. Are you what? Huh? Oh, okay. That's surprising. Nintendo. That is really surprising, but that's really cool. Yeah. I can't believe we're getting the HD remix of the first two as well. Well, I definitely have to play through those then. So that's awesome. Really happy. Play three, one, and two in that order. Okay. The entire Erdrick Erdr trilogy. All right. Awesome. Can't wait to see it. That was awesome. Thank you, Mr. Hori. We hope you're excited to play the entire Erdrick trilogy now in HD 2D. I am very excited. 
<laughs> Let's continue with more headlines. Shall we? No Let's god. Have some fun. Freddy Fazbear. Say hello to Freddy Fazbear. Jaws. Wait. He man? Great Scott. Is that Marty McFly? The world of Funko is coming to life. Oh god. An adventure mashup. Freddy Fazbear. Play with more than 60 characters Ugh. as you explore locations based on over 20 iconic movies, TV shows, and more. Freddy Fazbear Use special skills and crafted gadgets to explore Even more Epic Freddy Fazbear with their own unique puzzles, hidden areas, and familiar foes. Dinosaurs from Jurassic World and Cylons from Battlestar Galactica. They're certainly not hmm. toying around. Unbox the universe when Funko Fusion pops onto Nintendo Switch oh God. September 13. What next? We've oh. got a smorgasbord of spooky, silly, and strategic games. Luigi's Mansion? Not a feeling. When you say spooky, Ready there's only one game. Yes. Emotions? This game was great. I love this game. Summon your courage. I like all the Luigi's Explore Mansion games. Multiple mansions filled with goofy ghosts. <laughs> tricky traps. And other supernatural uh, shenanigans. Death defying drops. Luigi's Mansion 2 HD launches on Nintendo Switch June 27th. Pre orders uh, are now on Nintendo bonk. eShop. Meet the quirky little uh, demo man. Find him, catch him, and what lead the hell? a joyful RPG adventure. Are these me's? What are they? Explore Why do they have like me like faces? Monsters. The faces make me think Customize of me's. All sorts of outfits. Decorate your island however you'd like, and more. For some reason, it's Plus, making me think of four players in local co-op can team up to catch special Dempa Man. The new Dempa Man is free to play and launches as a timed exclusive on Nintendo Switch, July twenty second. Cool. Strategize Metal Slug. Away in this tower defense installment of the Metal Slug series. Huh, Metal Slug. Never played, but I've seen play I've seen it before. Pulverize enemy stronghold. Cool pixel art. Choose from over 300 units with different abilities. Giant tank. And build out your decks to win tactical tussles. Aren't these games normally like a uh... slug it out with I can't remember what the battles. like I don't remember what exactly Metal you call them, but aren't road. they like a uh... the shoot 'em up normally? Today. Oh, hey, nice. Aren't they like normally like shoot 'em ups like Contra or something? On an expedition of the day Dark yet darker? Or darker, darkest dungeon? Why I mix up the name? I feel like any. I feel like I mix up names all the time. Gosh dang it! What game is Dark yet darker? What? I'm pretty sure there's a game yet by the name Dark yet darker, but I can't remember. Maybe I'm just maybe I'm just also having a Nintendo Switch. Maybe it's I don't know Mandela effect. Maybe there is no game called Dark Yet Darker, but I'm almost positive there is for some reason. Whatever, I'm getting sidetracked. What's next? More classic titles oh, okay. Away. What do we got? Ah! Four swords. Classic 16-bit adventure and team up online to explore randomized dungeons in the Legend of Zelda: A Link to the Past. Four swords. Huh. All right, Metroid Experience Zero Mission. The remake of Samus's first adventure in Metroid Zero Mission. Huh. Hey, Craig. Plus, coming to the new Nintendo 64. Uh, what the? Nintendo Switch Online Mature 17. What is this? What? Games. What do you mean? Turok. The dangerous lost land to stop the campaigners' uh. nefarious schemes in Turok, Dinosaur Hunter. And. And what's this? Perfect Dark. Corporation to end their alien conspiracy in Perfect Dark. I've heard of this now game. Online multiplayer. Ah, I've heard of this game before. All four games will be available for Nintendo Switch online later Plus today. Members later today. Set sail to save the day. Be a hero. This is Verona, a young woman with the ability to communicate with phantoms. <laughs> Dead people. I will take all of this girl. Join her on a journey to save Chibi her art. friend Ash. Whoa. 
in this new installment in the Phantom Brave series. Nerd. You. Take on tactical turn-based <laughs> battles. I'm, okay. That's a bit bold. I'm going to be real with you. That lag. <laughs> That's a bit bold. Uh, to show off that kind of lag. With certain objects to <laughs> that almost makes me think of when they first showed off Xenoblade Chronicles 3. I'm pretty sure when they first showed that, that off, wasn't it really laggy? There was another game, or was it, or was it Pokemon Legends Arceus that was really laggy when they showed it? Either way, that's pretty ballsy, I'm gonna be real. Combined with Morona herself for show-stopping abilities <laughs> that can turn the tide of battle. Phantom Brave, the uh. lost hero. That's so was funny, sorry. Switch next year. This one's going to take that, you for a what ride. What the? Fighting? Seven arcade games featuring what Marvel the? and Capcom characters are fighting their way onto Nintendo Switch as huh. one collection. Marvel vs. Capcom fighting collection or whatever. Duke it out in Marvel vs. Capcom 2 New Age of Heroes. Huh. Take down the kingpin in the beat em up side scroller, the Punisher, and more. Okay. Probably gonna be a good amount of people that are happy with that. Training mode to polish your fighting skills and combos. She even got hitboxes. Select online mode to challenge rivals around the world. I'm sure there are gonna be plenty of people happy with this. This is cool. Or play co op in the Punisher. It sounds, sounds like there'll be a lot of people happy with that. Cross over to the museum to view artwork. Concept art from each game. I wanna take a Marvel vs. Yeah. Capcom Fighting Collection Arcade Classics launches on Nintendo Switch sometime this year. Up. Oh. Wah! Wah! Mario Party! A bigger, bolder Mario Party. The latest game in the Mario Party series takes place on an enormous island resort. Oh God! Hold Get on. Pause. Into the biggest selection of Mario Party mini games yet in Super Mario Party Jamboree. Oh no! Super Mario Party, you say? First, let's see some of the new boards where you'll compete to collect the most. Hey, stars. wait! Wait a minute. What? Take the escalators to travel between. Oh, here's a shopping Rainbow mall. Galleria. Use in-game coins to get a star at half price when they're on flight. You can play the ninja? But act fast. Ride around and stay on track in Rollum Raceway. With the new Turbo Dice item, you can move Whee! up to 40 spaces with a lucky roll. Here on Goomba Lagoon, the ebb and flow of the tide can change your path. And huh. things really get mixed up when the volcano blows Goomba its up! Along with five new game boards, two boards from previous Mario Party games, oh, hey. and their return. Yeah. Some mini games are action packed challenges, uh. speed trials, a battle of wits, and more. And some are controlled by gently shaking oh, boy. or tilting your Joy Con. Here controls. we go again. With over 110 mini games, there's a wide variety uh. to enjoy. Also, Koopathalon. Koopathalon. Oh, God. What do you mean 20 players at once? Oh, God. Still, a new Mario Party is always nice to hear. Let's just hope it's good. Biggest Mario Party yet will soon be underway when the Super Mario Party Jamboree game launches on the Nintendo Switch system October 17th. All right, let's hope it's good. That was uh, the latest installment wait, whenever you Mario go back Party to you, series. it's always something big. Super Mario Party Jamboree. With new boards, mini games, 20 player online gameplay and more. Get ready for the biggest Mario Party in series history. And now, please take a look at this. What are you doing? It's... Hmm? Oh, what? What is this? Huh? This looks adorable. It's Link's Awakening Link. <laughs> or the remake Link's Awakening. What is this? Is this a Link to the Past? Or what is this? Yoda. Oh god, the spear! Oh god! 
shoot! <laughs> oh! She's free! Oh god! Oh god, what the heck? Oh, what the... Oh my gosh, is this a... Is this a game where you actually play as Zelda's the main character? That actually be a fascinating, if so. What is this? Is this a new Legend of Zelda? The Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. This is a new Zelda game. Oh my. Do you actually play Hello, Zelda? I'm AGL oh, Numa, you caught my interest. Of the Legend of Zelda series. Tell me more, tell me more, tell me more. Tell me more. What you just saw was the latest installment the Legend of Zelda Echoes of Wisdom. They're even using the Link's Awakening style. Around, Link has vanished. Yes! Now, it's up to Princess Zelda to step as into bad as that sound. Room. Yeah, that's gonna be awesome. Might be thinking, will Zelda fight with a sword then? I'm actually curious. Here, we wanted to create a new gameplay style that breaks conventions seen in past Legend of Zelda games with a top-down perspective. I'm curious. To explain more, please take a look at this video. Yeah, let me see. I'm very curious. A game where you actually get... I was always wondering... Stolen away. I was always wondering... Oh, Across God. The, vast lands of Hyrule, the world has been eaten. Have appeared and have taken many nope. people, including Link. Nope. Now alone, Zelda meets the fairy Tri. Oh. Receives a mysterious staff called the Tri-Rod and sets Ooh. off on a journey across Hyrule to save God. her kingdom. Yeah! So she gets By a staff. The tri rod at a table she found, Zelda learned how to create an imitation of it called huh? an echo. What? Once you learn an echo of something, you can recreate it whenever you'd like. Oh gosh, what? Even if there's a wall blocking your path, you oh. can create echoes of tables to get a leg up. Huh. Okay. Just like that. Interesting. You can create wooden boxes, old beds, and jars usual things like water blocks what how you use them separately or together Whoa. is entirely up to you oh that's interesting Learn and create echoes of things you find while exploring hyrule well, how do you fight then you might be surprised at what you discover <laughs> zelda's learned the power to create and she's now Even making oh gosh different yeah i'm curious pick up and throw a rock echo for example but oh. that's not all though you can also create echoes what? of monsters. What do you mean? After doing so, they'll fight by your side. Oh, what the? Monsters have different abilities, so choose the one you Whoa. want to create based on the situation. Huh. Wisdom is key after all. Really? It's a more puzzle-oriented game in a way. Oh God, the void. This is awesome. I actually really like the different take. It's very different. In a high rule without Link, the fate oh, of the Deku. is now in Zelda's hands. Oh, Golem! How was that? Awesome! I hope you enjoyed this demonstration of the Echo ability, which channels Princess Zelda's wisdom. There are a lot of Echoes in this game. I can tell. To be honest, I haven't counted them all yet. But what do you mean? How you solve puzzles and battle enemies will change depending on the echoes used. In short, we've created a game where each player's experience will be different. Oh, you didn't even have a read ends. Zelda, echoes of wisdom. Oh, this looks awesome. 26th. A Nintendo Switch Lite system inspired Ooh. by the Legend of Zelda series will also be available at launch. That's pretty. We hope you're looking forward to playing as Zelda in this new adventure. I'm very excited. That'd be awesome. I'd like to return this moment I'd stolen away back to Mr. Takahashi. Oh, well, okay. Thank you, Hi there. Aonuma. Please look forward to the newest entry in the Legend of Zelda series. Yeah. Let's see a few more headlines. All right, we're almost done. We've got 10 minutes left or something. Let loose and oh, great. Here you go. Here's your dancing. I feel like this is also something I need to talk over because I don't know if I'll get copyright or anything over this, but if I talk over it too much and make it unnoticeable, maybe I won't have to go. Hey, no. You know what? I feel like I need to. No. You're not winning this. I'm not, ch I'm not chancing fate. That's muted for now. 
I don't care. I do not care. I am not chancing fate here. <laughs> Nintendo secret attack. Copyright strike. Copyright attack. Go. No. <gasps> you are doing an awfully long trailer for this. I'm going to be real with you. All right, we get it. All right, I think I can turn the auto back on. A new <sighs> adventure is on the horizon. Oh yeah, they showed this on another. Uh, it's the world of Horizon. Yeah, the they showed this at another thing. On a quest to save the world uh, was it at the evil. Xbox thing or the the Summer Games Fest games. thing? It was one of the two that this thing was originally showed off at. Pretty sure. And traverse other locations inspired by the original game, but be careful. <sighs> Swarms of machines are lurking <sighs> everywhere. I still have to play through the original. I've heard gadgets, people like, like it. Blast boots and gravity bombs to hunt them down. From the, nimble the original uh, Horizon Zero Dawn, I mean. I have it, I just haven't really played it. As you progress, you can help Robot, you can turn it into an amusement park. With lots of Hot dog. Garrett. Oh, and you don't have to explore this vast wilderness alone. Team up with familiar faces from the world of Horizon in two-player local or online co-op. Hmm. Huh. Lego Horizon Adventure. Funny, I guess. On Nintendo Switch this holiday. That is kind of weird seeing the PlayStation logo up top left. <laughs> A stray oh! journey begins. Cat! It's this game. Why is it so grainy looking? Whoa. Kitty, no! No! Kitty! <laughs> No. Experience a decaying cyber city through the eyes of a cat separated from their family and friends. Depression. Explore alongside a drone known as B12 to Yo. find your way home. Oh, that's day to call me. Carefully climb to the highest heights. Create new paths for yourself. And stealthily squeeze into tight spaces. Think like a cat to make your way through the cause city. cause destruction of property. Not everyone is excited to have you slinking around. Oh god. Including hordes of hostile creatures uh, ready to swarm. Ticks exploring to venture into more areas of this unfamiliar world and make your way back to safety. Uh. Stray finds its way onto Nintendo Switch this holiday. Cat Welcome home, Hobbit. What? If you've ever wanted to live like a Hobbit from the Lord of the Lord Rings, of the Rings now, type game, leisurely existence. I don't really know anything about it. I've never actually watched of Lord of the Rings. I don't watch yours. a lot. Of, I don't watch Customize really your anything. <laughs> Decorate your home and settle into I mean, I'm not much of a movie or watcher or TV show watcher, honestly. That might be attributed to ADHD, maybe. Share a meal. I can only really, I mean, it's also the fact that they just, I don't honestly find them as, they just don't seem as interesting to me personally. I mean, good for whoever likes them, it's just, it's not for me. Still though, I, I'm excited for, um, first off we got Mario and Luigi game, and then we have the, we have the Zelda game, and of course we have the Dragon Quest games, I'm excited for all of those. Oh! Oh! You're kidding me! No way! You're freaking kidding me! No freaking way! After I outside of Japan, are you freaking kidding me? As one collection, as the are you freaking kidding me? Miles Edgeworth, take the case out of the room and investigate crime scenes. I swear, I literally just played through these games. Use the power so you're telling me that I just had to wait? Enjoy what do you mean? Character visuals from the original series. Oh my gosh! Or swap to the original sprite. You even have the original look. Take a break from your investigation to explore the gallery. Where you'll find what do you mean? Music, including orchestral gosh dang! And more. I'm happy these are out, but gosh dang it! I just had to wait. 
any cost. Uh, Ace Attorney Investigation gosh dang it. launches on Nintendo Switch Why? September 6th. Pre-orders begin later today. I literally just Nintendo played through these games. I'm happy they're out though. I'm very happy. What is this? Is this Danganronpa style or raincoat style? What the hell? Uh, what the? Oh god! Oh, what the? Uh, uh. After a devastating attack by unknown assailants, Takumi Samino's life gets turned upside down. Uh. A mysterious school mascot suddenly appears. While Takumi manages to get out of harm's way, he's then forced to enroll at the Last Defense Academy huh? along with 15 other students. Oh my god, I'm literally... Their mission is to defend the school from hostile student enemies for 100 what the... days. An academy shrouded in secrecy. Uh, I'm literally playing through the Dong and Rapa games. Of allies. Can Takumi survive this hundred day trial colored by extreme and despair and return to his normal uh, life? There's the, the word. Of Don Gunrampa present the hundred line last defense academy. Well, now I got Watch another game to freaking. Uh, yeah. Embark on a saga what is this? spanning generations. A full remake of Romancing Saga 2 is marching on to Nintendo Switch. I, I'm still just... This direct's been fantastic for me. Mario, Luigi, Dragon Quest, freaking Danganronpa related stuff by the creators of Danganronpa. Heroes who have turned to darkness. You're kidding me! This direct has been amazing! And the Legend of Zelda game! And finally, the main character will be Zelda. This direct has been amazing to me, honestly. Where the action order is key. That dog and that uh, 100 days game looked amazing, though. I'm not the best with strategy type things, but I'll still play it. After all, it's it's related to the guys that made a uh, dog and Rapa. I feel like I have to. Uh, Sorry, your I'm being ridiculous. Heroes. Otherwise, the vengeful seven heroes may emerge victorious. <sighs> Romancing Saga 2, Revenge of the Seven. Anyways, this game looks neat too. Switch, October 24th. I have to keep an eye on that. Look kind of neat. Is it one last time? Hope you're excited to experience the full remake of Romancing Saga 2. That's almost everything for today. What's the last direct. announcement? Next will be our last announcement. All right, Please the big boy. Look. It's time. What is it? Cosmere 20X9. Galactic Federate. What do you mean? What is this? What is this? What is this? What? Is no way. What is this? What is this? Metroid Prime? Ah. Uh -huh. Boy, what? This is Metroid Prime, right? There's no way. Is this the one that is this it? Could this be? I was saying that it wouldn't happen. There's no shot. This has to be a remake of one of the other ones, right? This has to be a port. There's no way they actually... There's no way. There's no actual way. They would do it as a release title for the second... Uh, for the Switch's successor. There's no way they would release it on the Switch. So this has to be a port. Right? 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 Oh! What do you mean? It's real! Oh! 
What do you mean? What do you mean? My hand hurts. Holy sh... It's a real... I... What? What? Amazing. Yeah. That was a first look at Metroid Prime 4. Hand hurts. Ow. After a very long the world time, is going to break. We are finally able to share more it's real. This title. Release is planned for 2025. <gasps> so please wait a little bit longer. Oh my God, it's real. Forward to Samus Aaron's it's real. <laughs> That's all for today's Nintendo. Drive. Yes. Thank you for watching. Ow. I need to stop slamming my hand. I'm sorry. Oh, my hand hurts. This was amazing! <laughs> Welp! As much as I would like to continue my uh, overexcitement, I need to get other things done right now. But this direct was awesome! This was amazing! Can't wait. To, there are probably going to be a couple games here that I'll be playing through on the channel, definitely. But that'll have to be for later. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed, and hope to see you all later. Peace!